This is Italian Football Lover channel my friends. I want to talk about next weekend's Serie A games and I want to show you Serie A table of this week and uh, I want to give you results by talking and I, uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna make a little bit evaluations of last weekend's game and teams in Serie A. Let's start Milan has 40 points. They are in the first Serie A table. Uh, they won against Torino last weekend 2-0 and uh, they are going on so good. Uh, although uh, there were so many injuries in Milan. Uh, Rebic, Ibrahimovic, uh, Benasser, Tonali. But uh, they won against Torino and they are going so good under the management of Stefano Pioli. They are the first team in Serie A with 40 points. AC Milan. And second position Inter has uh, 37 points. Uh, in the last two games they lost five points. They lost against Sampdoria 2-1 and this last weekend they stayed draw against Roma in away game 2-2. Uh, I think uh, they uh, got one point from Roma. Uh, there was no problem but they lost three points against Sampdoria in away game. It was so important three points for Inter uh, and they are second in Serie A. Uh, Roma in third position with 34 points in Serie A. This season Roma is going on so good under the management of Paolo Fonseca. Really Mkhitaryan, Jacob Pellegrini uh, playing so good on the forward and on the midfield. Veretut, Villar. Uh, they are so successful I think. Uh, they are playing for first teams uh, in Serie A. Uh, fourth place Juventus has 33 points. They won against Sassuolo last weekend at home 3-1. Uh, the late goal of Aaron Ramsey and Cristiano Ronaldo. Sassuolo played with 10 players uh, before they won against 3-1 uh, against Milan in away game 3-1. Juventus is going on uh, so good, uh, but they are playing uh, for championship this season. Uh, very exciting championship competition is going on in Serie A this season. Really, Serie A is going on so good this season. In fifth place, Atalanta has 31 points. They won against Benevento last weekend in a away game 4-1. Uh, after Champions League games uh, were ended, uh, Atalanta is going on so good. They got the good results after Champions League games. And sixth place, Napoli has 31 points. They won against Udinese 2-1 in a away game. Uh, in the last minute, last minute goal of Bakayoko 2-1. Uh, they are uh, going good, but uh, they got the bad results at home. Uh, in last games, they lost against Spezia 2-1, and they draw against they stayed draw against 1-1 Torino. And seventh place, Sassuolo 20. Nine points. They made so many surprises this season. Sassuolo is the surprise team of this season in Serie A. Really, uh, Roberto De Zerbi is uh, so successful and clever coach, I think. They lost against uh, Juventus 3-1 in a way game, but they played uh, with 10 players in the second half. Uh, eighth place, Lazio has 28 points. Last weekend, they won against... 2-0 uh, Parma in away game uh, but this season uh, they are uh, they are not close to first four teams uh, in Serie A and ninth place Verona 27 points they won against Crotone 2-1 last weekend and Benevento has 21 points uh, they are going so good under the management of Filippo Inzaghi. They uh, lost against 4-1 uh, Atalanta at home last weekend. And Sampdoria has 20 points. They lost against 2-1 Spezia. Uh, Sampdoria is so unstable team. It's so hard to predict what time Sampdoria wins, what time Sampdoria lose. They have 20 points. And Fiorentina has 18 points. They won against Cagliari 1-0 but uh, Fiorentina is going so bad this season, I think. And Bologna has 17 points. And they lost against Genoa in a away game 2-0 last weekend. 
uh, they are about to uh, relegate and Spezia has 17 points they won against uh, Sampdoria last night 2-1 at home and before they won against Napoli in away game 2-1 they got uh, the six points in the last two games Serie A uh, and Udinese has 16 points and they lost against Napoli at home 2-1 uh, they couldn't get the win for eight uh, seven or eight games in Serie A they are going so bad and they are about to relegate position in Serie A and Cagliari has uh, 14 points and uh, they, lo they lost against uh, Inter, they lost against Atom Benevento 2-1 before the last week and this week, uh, last weekend they lost against Fiorentina 1-0 uh, but they are about to relegate position in Serie A also Genoa has 14 points but after uh, coach Ballardini came to Genoa they are going so good and uh, they won against Bologna last weekend 2 0 at home before they won against Spezia 2 1. And they, uh, Genoa is collecting the points in Serie A with new coach Ballardini. And, but they are in a uh, relegation position in Serie A. Uh, Torino has 12 points and they lost against Milan in away game at 2 0. Uh, and Parma has 12 points. And uh, their old coach Roberto Daversa came back, but uh, they lost against uh, Lazio 2 0 at home last weekend. And in last position, Crotone has just nine points, and they lost against Verona last weekend 2 uh, 1. Uh, they are about to relegate really to Serie B. Uh, this season, really, there are uh, so good struggle for championship Milan Inter Roma Juventus and the first four first four teams there are so many candidates candidates for first teams Atalanta Napoli uh, Roma all they are playing for first four teams in Serie A this season and they are uh, they are very good uh, struggle for not to relegate to Serie B and uh, Udinese, Cagliari, Genova, Torino, Parma, Crotone, they are about to uh, relegate to Serie B and uh, they are struggling not to relegate to Serie B. This season is uh, so exciting season in Serie A, really. I advise you to watch the Serie A games and uh, all my comments like this uh, last weekend's uh, Serie A games, teams and results. You can subscribe to my channel, watch my videos, uh, please open up your notification links, notification bells uh, and you can write your suggestions and comments under my video. Uh, at the same time, uh, Thursday night uh, I am going to publish my prediction video for Serie A. I am going to make predictions about this weekend's Serie, game, Serie A games. Uh, in on Thursday night and I am going to upload my video thank you very much and see you on my next videos bye